Hey Mike with Enviroscape LA and I'm here at our latest project and I got to tell you this is a little piece of my heart that's gone mm -hmm. into this project because I think that America needs to get back to basics. Uh, we need to get back to healthy eating. The world is full of pesticides and herbicides and GMOs and you know what? It, we need to do something seriously. We need to do something about it. There's also a drought that we're plagued with, and it, you know, so all these things, as a professional landscape contractor for over 30 years, I've been thinking about this, and I've been thinking, how can we have something in our yard that's beautiful, save water, lower our grocery bills, and I want to present to you the high antioxidant garden created by Enviroscape LA. And what this is, it's a koi pond. And you know, you might be thinking, wait a minute, a koi pond, but does not waste water. Well, not if it recirculates the same water over and over again. You put fish in there and you can enjoy it. You can meditate by it. You can just have fun. You, nothing like having a, you know, uh, your favorite drink and then sitting down after a long day. Who needs, uh, uh, who, who needs medicines, um, tranquilizers? Who needs any of that stuff? You sit down here for an hour, and it's the equivalent of, of, of having it been tranquilized by a tranquilizer gun. I mean, I'm just saying, this is amazing. This is going to be beautiful. We just built it today, so the chlorine's working out of the water. Uh, probably this weekend we're going to do fish. I'll have a follow-up video with this. But one of the things I wanted to point out to you was the plantings that we did around this. <laughs> the ones in the back are called Budleas, and they're minute miniature types, they're butterfly bushes, they have those uh, purple spires, and those purple spires will actually, uh, they actually smell really good, but they're like a magnet, if there's a butterfly in the area, it will just, like a magnet, it'll just, it'll just pull it in. Hummingbirds love them, and what about the butterflies? Well, the, did you know the only food for butterfly is the milkweed, the escapulous plant, that's the pentacle mold. We have a whole hillside of it planted on, on both sides here. But I, I'll do, I'll do a follow-up video when this stuff is uh, filled in in about a month or so. It's going to look absolutely gorgeous, but it, uh, it's a koi pond. It has native plants around it, but it doesn't stop there. <laughs> okay, the, the homeowner, too, uh, put synthetic turf here, so that's one way to cut, cut out... Uh, your water usage and gardener and your gardener <laughs> nothing like uh, fertilizing it mowing it then your gardener takes all that gasoline to come every week just to cut it uh, basically the cutting is full of all the fertilizer and nutrients and then you send it to the dump who came up with that idea <laughs> so okay now here's what here's where it gets really really exciting we put in an auxiliary pump in this koi pond. The koi pond is going to push water up to these towers. And let's take a look up here. These towers are their vertical gardens, and they grow food. You see the kale here? Cucumber. Okay, so this thing is just starting to grow. The, the tomatoes. So this is really an awesome system. It, it has a pipe right here that pushes water, pond water, up to the top, and then it billows down and it hits all the roots, and then it travels back down. Once the roots are taken, the roots are taking the nutrients, travels back down to the pond. So it cleans the excess pond nutrients out. Now I've got for the solids because Coyer, like people, they have solid waste and liquid waste, we'll say. Well, the solid waste will get trapped by this Milasa uh, filter. This is called uh, the Biotech, and it's got a UV to keep the experience clear, uh, clear drink, clean water. It's got sponges down here. We'll do another video on that. A, a pond is like a big toilet bowl. This will allow the toilet to flush. And the waste? So, and the waste? And, the, and then what we're going to do with, with the waste, we're going to be able to trap it with another pipe down here and pass it on vegetables. In fact, on the upper level of this, a homeowner, uh, Charlie, actually put the fruit trees. She's got an orchard up there. Fabulous. This is going to be, this is living water, liquid compost. 
doesn't get any better than this, folks. And so I just wanted to share this with you because it's a way to use very little water. In fact, these things, these uh, uh, vertical gardens actually save 70, oh, excuse me, 95% water over a regular soil garden. I mean, this is phenomenal, and it's using pond water. The pond water is actually living water. Like I said, it's the slippery compost. It's the best water you could possibly use for growing food. So, more information, uh, go on my website, enviroscapela.com. Or give me a call, Mike from Enviroscape LA. When you think sustainability, think Enviroscape LA.